Hello guys, welcome again to another lesson. In this one, let's talk about the basic of mesh editing, okay? First, let's select the object and then let's enter in edit mode by clicking on tab or using this menu over here, okay? Um, and now, in edit mode, we can do transformation just like we do on object level. Uh, I am going to show you, for example, if you select one vertex, one vertex, okay, and you want to move them, to move it, you can use the menu over here, or you can use the G to grab it and move it, okay? This is exactly the same when we have talked about moving objects. To select, as I told you in the previous tutorial, is the same, you just need to click, okay? To scale, for example, if I select this face over here and I want to scale, you have the same options that we have discussed on the, when we have discussed the, the how to scale an object, just select the face and press S if you want to use the shortcut key or you can use the menu over here and scale it, okay? Don't forget, and I am going to repeat, uh, for mesh editing, the, the tools that you use to, to, to edit are the same that you use to transform your object. The scale, the rotate that I am talking now, okay, and the move. If you have a face selected, it will move the faces. If you have an edge selected, it will move the edge, etc., etc., etc. Okay? Um, now that I am in edit mode, for example, another thing that I want to, to show you is, for example, if I create another object, for example, Shift A to create, Let's create a cube. Let's move the cube. Okay. Now I have two objects, but with a difference um, if I have created in object mode. Well, the main difference is that if I go to object mode and click on one object, it will select both objects. Okay. That's because they are basically two different objects, but they belong to the same objects because I have created inside of edit mode. Please, this is important for you to understand. Uh, I will repeat the process. For example, if I create an object in object mode, a cylinder, we have this object and we have the older one. But if I go to edit mode and create another object, okay, this object is another object but um, is part of all these ones. If I exit the edit mode and I click on one of them, as you can see they all three became selected, okay. For Blender this is one object only. It is composed by uh, um, I'm sorry by um, a cube by another cube a little bit the form that I have created and by a cone but this is only an object um, I hope that you like it now we have uh, approached and we have talked about the basics of blender uh, in the next lessons, uh, I think that uh, it's going to be a little bit better because we are going to to start uh, and working uh, with uh, some uh, more difficult and more advanced tools. I hope to see you soon and subscribe my channel if you like it.